guys are not going to believe the bold response that was made by Fikile Mbalula to Helen Zile. We'll be talking about the truth about the government of national unity, that is the GNU. So before proceeding to this particular video, please hit the subscribe button if you're new and please hit the bell notification button so you can be the first to be notified when we get to drop a new clip. Well, the South African political landscape is buzzing with tension as the African National Congress issues a stark warning against attempts to undermine the GNU. Well, following a recent statement from Democratic Alliance's leader, Helen Zille, who claimed that there is no GNU but merely a coalition between the ANC and DA, AN6 Secretary General Fikile Mbalula has stepped out to address the issue. Well, his remarks come after a crucial ANC National Executive Committee meeting and Legotla highlighting the ongoing political drama. Well, the government of national unity was established in order to ensure political stability and inclusiveness in South Africa's complex political environment. It involves multiple parties working together to govern, aiming to balance power and represent diverse interests. The ANC, which happens to be a leading party in this government, has been at the center of efforts to maintain this coalition's unity despite growing tensions and political maneuvering from opposition parties like the DA. Helen Zille, who happens to be the leader of the DA, recently sparked controversy by suggesting that the GNU is a facade arguing that the real governance is a simple coalition between the ANC and the DA. Well, this assertion challenges the legitimacy of the GNU and implies a breakdown in its intended inclusivity. Zile's claim has been met with criticism and concern from various political figures and observers who fear it may destabilize the existing political framework. Well, in response to Helen Zile's statements, Fikile Mbalula, the ANC's Secretary General, issued a firm warning against any attempts to divide the GNU. Speaking after the ANC NEC meeting and Lekotla, Mbalula emphasized that the GNU is intact and continues to function effectively even without the DA's involvement. He assured the public that the ANC is committed to maintaining the stability and effectiveness of the government. Mbalula's remarks are a clear message that the ANC will not be swayed by opposition claims and remains steadfast in its commitment to the GNU. All this response underscores the ANC's determination to preserve political stability and unity despite external pressures and criticisms. The recent developments highlight the ongoing challenges faced by the government of national unity. Helen Zille's comments and the ANC's strong rebuttal reflect deeper political tensions and the complexities of coalition governance in South Africa. While the ANC's stance demonstrates its commitment to keeping the GNU functional and cohesive regardless of opposition tactics, this situation points to the broader issue of political stability and the difficulties of managing the coalition government in a dynamic political environment. The ANC's position could have significant implications for South Africa's political future, particularly in how it manages relationships with other parties and responds to opposition criticism. As the political landscape continues to evolve, the ability of the GNU to maintain unity and effectively govern will be closely scrutinized. Well, we have some questions for you. Do you agree with Helen Zille's assessment of the government of national unity? How important is it for the ANC to maintain the unity of the GNU? Well, what are your thoughts on the effectiveness of coalition governments here in South Africa? Leave your thoughts just down in the comment section, guys.